Good morning, with Warriors. This is Marily. And Diana. Today is Wednesday, April 12, 2023. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behavior. Please be seated. It's allergy season, and the best way to stay healthy is to wash your hands regularly for 20 seconds. Use hand sanitizer when needed, and sneeze or cough in your arm. Most importantly, if you are really sick, stay home. Warriors, don't forget to use your agenda for your pass when traveling in the hallways. Your agenda should be with you at all times, even when you go to connections. Remember, a warrior is always responsible and respectful of the rules. We'll be right back after these messages. Macintosh presents Road Trip to Spring Gala 2023. Warriors, there are several show times from April 13th to April 15th. However, you can catch our eighth series in the April 15th show at 1 p.m. Tickets are $12. <laughs> There will be a track meeting at Macintosh High School on Friday, April 14th from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. It will be Booth versus Rising Star Middle School and Whitewater Middle School. Go out and cheer on your Warriors. Guess what? You're probably in the yearbook. Buy the yearbook at www.jossensyearbook.com. There are only 92 yearbooks left. You want your yearbook in time for the yearbook signing party. Get that yearbook. It's the book that brings memories back. If you are interested in creating the logo for next year's spirit wear, the t-shirt design are due on April the 14th. To find out the rules for the design, go to Schoology, select JC Booth, then student, then you will see the flyer. Just think the entire school could be wearing your design. This is the time of the year when everybody begins thinking about the upcoming milestone test. You still have a way to go. Milestone testing will be from April 24th through May 9th. Don't forget, a warrior is always responsible and respectful and ready to learn. And now for the character lesson. The word of the day is coterie. Coterie is a noun meaning an often exclusive group of persons with a similar pur purpose. The coterie of authors like to discuss their favorite books. I dare you to try and use this word today. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Ruby. And he's hi. With a few words of wisdom. Some of you might know who Mike Twain is. He's the man who wrote the book Tom Sawyer. He's famous for his good sense of humor. Now listen to what this great American writer says to us. The best way to cheer yourself up is to try to cheer someone else up. So next time you're feeling down, think about Mark Twain and give his idea and try a try offer a little good cheer to, to somebody else and notice if in the end it makes you feel better and cheers you up. But something to think about, this is Ruby and he's like, with the, okay. um, make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. Buenos días, Guerrero de Bus. Este es Leandro, letra del tiempo para el miércoles 12 de abril de 2023. La máxima de hoy será una de 68 grados y la mínima de 48 grados, con un 32% de lluvia. Eh, hoy puede haber receso. Mañana habrá una máxima de 66 grados y una mínima de 50 grados, con un 2% de probabilidad de lluvia. Que tengan un gran día, Guerrero. Good morning, Mood Warriors. This is Dawn bringing you the lunch for April 12, 2023. Your entrees will be walking taco with salsa, multi grain French bread pizza with marinara sauce, or a jammer pack. For your sides, you will have whole kernel corn, shredded lettuce with diced tomatoes, or Mexican brown rice. And as always, a choice of milk. Have a great day, Warriors. Happy
Happy birthday to our friend Liv! The Man in the Glass by Peter Wimbro. When you get what you want in your struggles for self, and the world makes you king for a day, just go to a mirror and look at yourself and see what that man has to say. For it isn't your father or mother or wife whose judgment upon you must pass. The fellow whose verdict counts most in your life is the one staring back from the glass. Some people might think you're a straight shooting chum and call you a wonderful guy. But the man in the glass says you're only a bum if you can't look him straight in the eye. He's the fellow to please, never mind all the rest, for he's with you clear to the end. And you've passed your most dangerous test if the guy in the glass is your friend. You may fool the whole world down the pathway of years and get pats on the back as you pass, but your final reward will be heartache and tears if you've cheated the man in the glass. Can I make another of your scissors? Yeah, sure. I'm sorry. Show on the project, man. Thank you. Hip hip hooray! No! I can't believe Mr. Stewart sent me out here because he thinks I'm going to touch someone. What did you do? Why did Dixon take on the today? Because it's the only pencil I need because of me.